Hey, it's Miss Sebastian. I'm here to help you with some consistent and independent, consistent and dependent and inconsistent from Lesson 5.04. Now, what you notice, okay, when we're talking about something being consistent, that means that that pair of lines, that system of equations, has a solution. Okay, so if you look at this first one, we could classify this as consistent because it does have a solution. It does meet right here where they cross. Okay, right here, this point, okay, would be the solution to those two equations. Okay, now consistent and dependent, if you notice, there's a line right here. Okay, but there is also, I'm going to get a darker marker. Okay, there's also another line sitting right on top of it. Those share all the points in that line. So this one would be consistent as well because it does have solutions. This one would be all solutions. Okay. And for something to be all solutions, that's the same as infinite. Okay, infinitely many. And because they sit on one another, they're the same line. Okay, I like to think of that as piggybacking. If you are having to ride on someone else's back, you're dependent on them. Okay, if, they, if the lines only cross one time, they are independent of one another. Maybe when you grow up and you move um, out of your parents' home, okay, you guys meet for dinner once a week. Okay, you're on your own, you're independent, okay, and you only meet once at a time. Whereas if you're living in the house, you are there all the time and you're dependent. Okay, you're on the same line, you're going in the same direction. Okay, maybe they have to take you to soccer or basketball, whatever it may be. They have to take you to the store. Okay, so you guys are always going the same path. Now, we've got this other one over here where you see two parallel lines. These lines never intersect. That means there is no solution. This is when you uh, refer to this line as inconsistent. Um, when you think of incomplete, it's not complete. When you think of inconsistent, it's not consistent. It has no solutions. Remember, consistent means it has a solution. Inconsistent means it has no solution. So let's go down here. I've got three different graphs. And we've got this first graph. Okay, and I'm going to... Draw one line with this purple. One line with this orange. Just so you could see it just a little bit better on the camera. If you saw this one, this is kind of like once you've moved out, okay, and you meet for lunch once a week or you meet for dinner or whatever, okay, they do have a solution. So it would be consistent, but you're off on your own, so you're independent. Okay, now if we were asked to find the solution, that means what time, what day do they meet to go out to dinner or whatever it may be, that solution is that point right there. And so all we have to do is find the ordered pair. So how do I do that? Well, you always look at your x value first. So I'm going to right here. My x value is 5. My y value is 4. So my solution to this system would be 5, 4. So it's just where they cross. Okay, let's look at this one. Notice there are two parallel lines. Okay, 
They never, ever, ever cross. Well, remember, a solution is where they cross. So if they don't, they would be considered consistent, or sorry, inconsistent. Consistent, yeah, inconsistent and no solution. And then last we've got this line. You see a line here, but you also have this other line. It looks like one line is piggybacking the other. When they are piggyback like that, one is dependent on the other. And remember that if they do have a solution, it is consistent. And when they share all points, they share all points and all solutions, that's the same as infinitely many. Okay, so remember, you have your three different sets of lines. You've got your consistent and independent, meaning they have one solution, and you can find that solution just by finding the ordered pair of where they cross. If you have one line piggybacking the other, it's infinitely many solutions, and it's consistent and dependent. Remember, it kind of looks like you're piggybacking one line with the other. So you're dependent on them to carry you around. And inconsistent is no solutions because they never cross. Hope this helps. This is 5.04.